Barcelona season has not exactly gone to plan so far, but it is far from unsalvageable. The arrival of Victor Rocky has brought new optimism to the fan base, but now he needs to show why he is so highly rated. Barcelona are currently third in La Liga and find themselves seven points behind both Real Madrid and Girona. It is not just the points gap that causes concern, it is that many of their wins have been by a narrow margin and in fortuitous circumstances, meaning it doesn't feel like sustainable form. One clear, one clear problem in the team is the lack of depth behind Robert Lewandowski, but Rocky's rival in January from Atletico Paranaense gives Sapi Hernandez a new striker to bring up the bench and perhaps start in late games later in the season. He was signed in the summer but scheduled to join in the following summer, but Barcelona had moved his rival that forward as he meets a need. Now that he has his first appearance in the bag, albeit a short one, let's take a look at how he got on against Las Palmas. Vitaro King versus Las Palmas We are working of just 13 minutes of action here because Rocky replaced Ferran Torres in the 78 minutes against Las Palmas on Tuesday night with uh, the score at 1-1 the pressure was on strike away because both Real Madrid and Girona had won their games the night before almost immediately Rocky saw an alternate to track a loose back pass from a Las Palmas defender but the goalkeeper managed to beat him to the ball causing a collision. Soon far after he actually ended up missing a really really good chance. Joao Felix clever little pass found Rocky almost on the penalty spot and in space but his first touch put the ball up in the air. That mean by uh, the time he could take his shot, the goalkeeper had begun to close in and he ended up putting the chains just wide of the post. That one will have kept him up during the night as he really should have scored but he was in the right area and still got his shot away despite the touch. The fact he came so close to scoring Susan into his Barcelona career in a positive it in itself. He didn't let it get him down in the moment as he was very quickly part of a pack of players that pressured and won the ball back in the final third he started grabbing toward two defenders with option on either side of him clearly desperate to score after that previous miss he took the wrong option and shoot it was deflected over the bar but the player to this right was the correct pass he only had 7 touches according to Ed B. Ray, but had 3 shoot and 1 on target from those 7 touches he looked to have an intensity that Barcelona need and was clearly getting in the right positions the goals which will come. How much did Vitoro Kikos Barcelona? Barcelona deals for Rocky was not a very simple one as few of their deals seem to be this day. The deal was made in July 2023 with the Brazilian expected to actually arrive in the summer of 2024. Overall, 
it is costing Barcelona just over 80 million euro or 52 million pound in total. The reason for the arrival being delayed a year was spending restriction. Barcelona then managed to bring it forward to January, but then there were serious concerns that they would not be able to register him to play in La Liga games, Sapi expressed optimism when he spoke to the media on Wednesday afternoon. With registration given the green light just a matter of hours later that means he could face Las Palmas. Sapi seemed confident that Rocky and Lewandowski could actually play together he can play with Lewandowski perfectly, the boss insisted he can play, wide or as a number 9, he will generate competition for all the forward in the squad, Lewandowski, Ferran Joao Felix, Rapinha, and Lamine Yamal, which is a big positive. We will take things step by step with him, he is a kid aged 18, so we can load him with responsibility now because he need time to adapt but he's ready to play and training well he is professional and quickly adapting to his new surrounding but we will be cautious